Welcome back to Wellness Lenses. Let's imagine that you've always wanted to learn how to play the piano, but you don't think you have enough talent. Well, I have a secret to tell you today that might just change the way you look at things. By the end of this video, you'll discover that you possess an incredible power within you, a power called neuroplasticity. If you understand how neuroplasticity works, you will not only be able to bust some learning myths, but you will also open up a world of possibilities. So, get ready to reach your full potential. We are going to go deep into the brain's complicated world and find out how it changes and adapts all the time. We'll clear up some common myths and give you information based on scientific research. Are you ready? Let's dive right in. Our brains are amazing. Complicated organs that are made up of billions of special cells called neurons. People thought for a long time that our brains were set from birth and could not change. But new research has shown that isn't true. Our brains are very flexible, able to change, and always reshaping themselves as we go through life. Neuroplasticity is the name for this process. Neuroplasticity means that the brain can change the way its nerve cells connect to each other and make new pathways. Every time we learn something new, these connections are made, strengthened, and made better. Think of your brain as a huge system of roads. As you learn, you make new links, which makes it easier for information to flow. The more you practice and do something over and over again, the stronger these connections get. This makes it possible to get better at skills and abilities. But did you know that there are some things you can do to speed up learning and make neuroplasticity work better? Let's find out more about them. First, let's talk about what a nap can do for you. Research shows that taking a 20-minute nap about four hours after learning something can help the brain learn faster and change the way it works. When you take a nap after learning something new, your brain rewires itself 10 to 20 times faster. This is because naps help to solidify and strengthen the new neural connections. This makes it easier to process and remember information. It takes two steps to learn something. The first step is deliberate learning which needs your full attention and active participation. During this stage, a neurotransmitter called acetylcholine marks certain connections or neurons that may later get stronger. This is where your focused effort and deliberate practice come into play. The second step of learning happens during deep sleep or states that are similar to sleep. During these times, the nervous system actually changes how it works. It's amazing to think that while we sleep, our brains are actively reorganizing and integrating the information we learned while awake. But what happens if you can't nap? Don't be afraid. Non-sleep deep rest or shallow naps of 20 to 30 minutes that don't involve sleep can also make neurons fire again and again, which speeds up learning. So, even if you can't take a nap, you can still help your learning by taking a break, closing your eyes, and letting your mind rest. Another interesting fact is that productivity may go down after about 90 minutes of focused learning. This is because our brains can only focus on one thing for so long. So it's important to know when you've done your best and to give yourself a break. Taking breaks not only keeps you from getting too tired, but also gives your brain a chance to think about what you've learned and get ready for more. By understanding and using these learning strategies, you can make the most of your brain's ability to change and speed up the learning process. Remember that it's not just about how much time you spend learning, but also about how well you learn and how often you take breaks. So, whether you take a nap, try non-sleep deep rest, or just take short restful breaks, you give your brain a chance to rewire and strengthen the connections between its nerve cells. If you use these methods, you'll see your ability to learn soar to new heights. I'm glad you're here with me today. Don't forget that you can change your mind, your skills, and your future. Accept the beauty of neuroplasticity and let your limitless potential shine brightly. See you in the next video.